This hack tip is brought to you by Jack Threads. Welcome to Hack Tip, the show where we break down the concepts, tools, and techniques for hackers, gurus, and IT ninjas. I'm your host, Darren Kitchen, and today we're having a lot of fun in Bash with Sed. It all begins with Mimi039, who recently posted a question Who needs Sed when there's Bash? To which I figured, um, because Sed's awesome. And if you haven't played with Sed, it, it is a fantastic stream editor. Um, so go ahead and check it out for mainly any Unix system, and it basically allows you to filter and transform text. Uh, it's also one of the you know most useful features is it allows you to do substitution, among other things. So man, Sed for all the fun stuff there. And as Mimi points out, say for example, if I were to set a variable, let's call our variable txt, and I'm going to set that to uh, Wanna buy a duck? All right, um, and then I echo dollar sign squiggly txt unsquiggly. Yeah, I know. Then there we go. I actually can see the famous Joe Penner catchphrase. And if you're too young to get a reference there, just go ahead and Google Joe Penner and then listen to some 30s area radio shows. It's amazing. Seriously, good stuff. Culture. Woohoo! All right, now say like for example, we would want to substitute the duck with a cow, and of course, it won't quack, but in this case, it's gonna be just as good. Now, we can pipe the output of the echo command into sed, and then with tack e for expression and s for substitution, we can actually go ahead and change the output based on our pattern. So for example, like I did before, echo the dollar sign txt, pipe that into sed with a tack e, and then go ahead and uh, give it a, a, a single quote, s slash duck, slash cow, and then slash, and then quote, close our quote, and there we go. Wanna buy a cow? Does it move? Anyway, of course not every system you encounter is going to have set installed, and trust me, swapping out ducks for cows is supremely useful even if you don't live on a farm. I mean, just using Bash, we can achieve the same results by issuing, get this, echo, dollar squiggly txt, slash duck, slash cow, and then end our squiggly, or whatever you want to call it. And there we go, wanna buy a cow. Now, to learn more, I highly recommend checking out the man page for bash. So simply enter man bash, and then do a forward slash to pull up the search field, enter two hash marks, or octothropes, or whatever you want to call it, scroll down and you will find pattern substitution. This is pretty cool stuff. So anyway, if you're interested, definitely scroll down there and check it out. And of course, we'll be back here in just a bit after a quick break. If you love alternative apparel brands like Kid Robot, Hurley, and Stussy, but you hate wasting cash, get this. You could score these premium brands at up to 80% off every day at Jack Threads, the invite-only shopping club for guys. They're serving up street, skate, and surfwear brands at brain-melting prices. Best of all, Hack 5's hooking you up. That's right, skip the wait list and join free at jackthreads.com H-A-K-5 to start saving instantly without having to leave the house. I want to say thanks again to Mimi and encourage you guys to share your tips, tricks, and tools with us, tips at hack5.org, and be sure to check out our sister show, Hack 5, for more great stuff every week just like this, and I'll be there reminding you to trust your techno -less. Just a bick, like a razor. You can put a razor behind me during that.